I've come to a conclusion. I am not going to the church tomorrow that I told this dude I was going to go to. I don't care about no church, bro. I really don't. I really don't care about no church, bro. The people I always meet, you could be from church. You could be from anywhere, bro. The gym, you could be from a store. People always feel threatened around me, bro. Just because of my presence. I'm not even going to waste my time with these fake folks, bro. These fake folks. I'm telling you, bro. When you're a chosen one, you don't understand, bro. Like I said in my other video, you really can't make friends with nobody. It don't matter what these people believe. It don't matter where they come from, what they believe in. They just will not like you, bro. They could be, they could believe in God, whatever. They could be in the Bible, but they will just, they will just want to size you up because you got what they don't got. You got that shine, bro. And that's why it's just like, yo, fuck them all, bro. That's really how I'm coming with it, bro. If you're not, bro, if you're not for me, if you're not trying to win with me, if you're not trying to succeed with me, bro, fuck you, bro. That's really how it is, bro. I don't care about you, bro. Like, I don't got no hate towards you. I don't got no negative feelings, but you're worthless to me, bro. You don't got no, you don't serve no purpose in my life, bro. You don't got none to offer, bro. If I try to come to advice to these types of people, bro, even if you try to come with advice to these types of people, you will get nothing, bro. You will get absolutely nothing, bro. You will get absolutely nothing, bro. Oh, God, bro. Yo! Hold on, one Thank you. No problem, God, God bless, bless you. you, brother. Thank you. I'm telling you, bro, you can't make friends with nobody, bro. Can't make friends with none of these people, bro, because they're all fake as fuck. And it's just, I'm just done. It's done being nice guy, bro. I'm done with that shit, bro. I try to make friends with... Oh, that's loud. I try to make friends with these people, bro. That be at... What's it called? I try to make friends with these people that be inviting me to the churches. I met this dude's friend group at the mall. These people are all looking at me like an alien, bro. They're all just weird as fuck, bro. Everyone just got self... They just got anxiety, bro. And I'm not judging them, but it's just like, damn, bro, you really can't make friends with nobody, bro. You can't make friends with nobody. No one got that energy that you got, bro. And it's like, it'd be feeling like a, a gift, of course, but then it feels like a curse because you can't relate to nobody. Everyone just gets threatened around you, bro. People want to, like, try to look more intimidating when you talk to them, bro. People are just weird, bro, just fake. They don't got no souls, bro. I can't mess with no one that got no soul. I can't even mess with a girl that got no soul. I'm telling you, bro. It's just crazy, man. And I know folks is going to hate me, but it is what it is, bro. You feel me? I'm just the first one to be truly real, and I don't care, bro. Niggas trying to tell me this and that, bro. But look at their life. Look at how they live, bro. They live like I just I don't I don't get it, bro. If you showed me results of how you are as a person, if I could see that you got light in you, bro. If I could see that you have like that spark in you, maybe I would believe in you and what you say, you know. But you don't. You just don't, bro. It's just it's just it's just it is what it is, bro. It truly is what it is. But me, I'm not falling for none, bro. I stay by myself. As soon as I try to stay by myself, that's when all these motherfuckers want to try to come to me, bro. Want to follow me, bother me, talk to me, and start conversations with me. And then they want to be my best friend. They want to be buddy, buddy. But then they end up seeing the type of person I am. And they realize, like, how smart I am and how much I know stuff. I'm not some dumb guy. And then they get threatened by it. They get offended. They get prideful. Oh, this guy thinks he knows everything. I'm like, bro, get the fuck away from me then. Go hang out with your lame-ass friends then, bro. Go hang out with that lame-ass girl, bro. You feel me? I don't got time for these low lives no more, bro. I've been trying to help y'all. I've been trying to save y'all, bro. Save yourself, bro. Get away from me, bro. It's crazy, man. You can't go out without anyone just trying to look at you, talk to you. It's like, bro, sheesh, man. It's all glory to God. Lord, forgive me for even swearing, bro. I'm just... I'm fired up. I'm beyond fired up, bro. I'm telling y'all, these people got me so annoyed, bro. I really went to the gym, bro. I really went to the gym just to take out that, that energy out on the weights, bro. 
like I just get better and better, bro. And these people just continue to hate and continue to be losers, bro. Like just straight up, bro. And then they try to hide behind their ego. They try to hide behind the false identity as though there's somebody like you too, right? They try to act like they got that 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 spark, that spark for life. They try to act like they got that high energy, but they're just they're just phonies, bro. They're just fakers and phonies. That's what the world is full of. It's just a bunch of NPCs, bro. Non-playable characters. People that don't have the character of Christ in them. They don't got that childlike joy. They don't got that freedom, bro. And I'm telling y'all, leaving y'all people in the comments, I really hope that y'all are 100% on this too, man. I hope y'all aren't out here just commenting stuff on my videos. And then when you're out in real life, you guys are just the same just like them, bro. It's just lame, man. It's just lame, bro. People hiding behind the Bible, bro. They ain't even doing work, bro. How you gonna tell me all these scriptures, but you can't even do work, bro? How you gonna tell me about all these scriptures, but you be falling to everything of this world, bro? You are totally trapped in this world, bro. How am I gonna listen to you? You ain't leading by example. Look at the way you are, bro. I really, like, I really do this, bro. I'm really, and then these motherfuckers trying to tell me what job you work. They trying to judge me off a job like motherfucker suck one then. That's how I knew these men were NPCs. That's how I knew this guy trying to talk to me about the Bible was an NPC, bro. I should have just minded my own business and not even talk to them because I was like, oh, these are some church people. Let's hear this. All these church people, every church per per person I've met is an NPC, bro. Like, it's so sad to say it, but it's the truth. Every church person I've met has been an NPC, bro. They are not fired up for the Lord, bro. They are not fired up for the Lord. And mind you, I'm not judging them. I'm not saying I'm better than them. But this is just a clear, honest analysis, bro. Maybe you could call it healthy criticism. Call it what you want. But I just say it how it is. Motherfuckers want me to be just quiet, right? They want me to be quiet. And they want me to just be like them. So that they feel they don't feel threatened, bro. When people see people that are naturally better than them. Not in an egotistical, braggadocious way, but when they see people that are just, they look like they're living be a better life, they get so infuriated and jealous. Like, bro, y'all are some losers. Go find the fucking life, you fucking loser. Go find the life. Stop watching mine, bro. Go grab some, go, go grow some balls. So all you men, bro, y'all men are some lames, bro. Y'all men are the definition of lames, bro. Because y'all just be trying to act all hard, look all hard, but look at you, bro. You doing everything for a woman that don't care about you, bro. She's not going to be with you in a couple years, not even a couple months, bro. I was talking to this girl at Forever 21, and we were just chopping it up, and then I was like, oh, you got a boyfriend? I wasn't even flirting with her, but she was like, yeah, and I was like, you know damn well you ain't gonna be with him forever. I was like, is that your forever boo thing? And she was like laughing and stuff. Trust me, this girl, she, she ain't gonna be with this man forever, and I told her straight to her face, bro. Like, it's just the truth, bro. It ain't like, you know, and she wasn't even mad. She didn't go off on me. She just was like, bro, because I'm not dumb, bro. I know how this game is, bro. And that's the thing. People just want to live in fantasy world and clown world, right? Y'all stay comfortable in clown world. Ignorance is bliss. Y'all have fun living the same boring ass lives, bro. Doing the same thing. Stuck at home, watching TV, watching the same thing, going on social media, looking at the same thing, not having anything new to do in your life, bro. Because that's what a lot of y'all people want. A lot of y'all people want relationships. A lot of y'all people want to act like you're on some shit, but then you guys are just lying. I be telling people straight to their face, bro. I seen a guy at the mall that was looking down and I was encouraging him, bro, because he was he's out here worried about some Dominican girl, bro. I'm like, get out of here. I'm like, bro, the only reason why you want this girl is because her pussy, bro. That's really it, bro. Like, that's the thing. Men need to really like embrace the truth. A lot of men have no balls, bro. They're just trapped, bro. Just straight up trapped, man. Like, bro, God bless Patrice O'Neal. God bless the men that are really exposing this and trying to help men better themselves, bro. Because a lot of the men are just scared, bro. They got fear in their heart. A godly man has no fear. The only thing I fear is God, bro. I don't fear no woman, no man, bro. If y'all want to fight, if y'all want to talk, we can talk, bro. I ain't scared of you dumbass demons, bro. These demons really think I'm going to be scared of them, bro. Get out of my face with that.
The only thing you should fear is our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Don't let these Bible motherfuckers try to tell you shit and they don't even live it, bro. They just go to church and they be on the same type of demonic things as everybody else in this world, bro. That's the thing. I really come down here with some peace, bro. I come out here with a good message and people want to try to tear me down. Man, fuck them all, man. That's how I'm coming, and it's getting real. Like, it's real. Like, I don't care, bro. The narcissists that I be seeing, bro, they be trying to hang out with me, bro. They think I'm going to just keep on just being all nice. Like, nah, bro, we could play the same game. We could dance. We could tango, bro. Y'all don't understand. I had an eventful day today. I was asking people at the mall and Target if they hate their job. I had some manager at Target get mad at me and try to threaten me. I was like, I ain't scared of you, bro. What you going to do, bro? She walked away. She got so mad crazy little bitch man no offense that's crazy little bitch hey bringing out the demons in these people these people just live in the fairy tale bro i'm here to break that bro no cap man but look i've got myself a little pizza that i'm about to bake up i'm about to enjoy myself i'm about to catch up on some reading take a nice shower and just who knows maybe i'll talk to y'all maybe i won't but y'all stay up bro